Patients usually would know uh, if they're heart failure candidates based on their symptoms, and that's where you would usually get referred to a heart failure clinic, uh, and we evaluate you based on your symptoms. So we usually look for patients who are symptomatic at rest or are symptomatic with a minimal activity. And based on their assessment of their functional capacity and other testing, uh, like putting patients on a treadmill to see how far they can actually walk, um, are, are ways that we get assessments of how you know, patients, if they would benefit from an LVAD or a heart transplant. Um, and usually that's the, the basics of it. Good candidates are patients who have what we call good end organ perfusion, meaning that their kidneys are still working well, that the degree of heart failure hasn't you know, damaged their kidneys, um, that their liver is actually working well as well. Uh, transplant candidates are usually tobacco free. Uh, and our requirement usually is six months of abstinence from tobacco uh, at our institution, and that's pretty common nationwide. Um, and good social support because it's not uh, an easy journey to do on your own.